Really excited for Quetico Provincial Park. What they've achieved is an International Dark Sky Park designation from the International Dark Sky Association. That International Dark Sky designation means that Quetico Provincial Park has the highest quality of dark sky available and measures put into place to protect against light pollution. It means that we're going to have, uh, you know, for, for years to come, a great uh, large area where the night sky will kind of show us the stars in all their glory. The International Dark Sky Association Day works to combat light pollution worldwide. Designation is granted after a rigorous application process, requiring applicants to demonstrate community support for dark sky protection and document designation-specific program requirements. Why would we want dark skies? Why is this something we want to focus on saving? So certainly um, the idea of light pollution is, is what we're going after here. And light pollution is artificial light that's coming into the night sky um, when it should be dark. This interrupts natural rhythms. Um, there are all kinds of wildlife that take their cues to come in and out of hibernation, plants to grow, when to grow leaves or not. Um, people in our sleeping uh, cycles as well all rely on that, that dark. So to have that protection in place is really important for rhythms. It's also important for science and our observations of the night sky. There are a lot of uh, both professional and amateur astronomers that rely on that dark sky to be able to make observations and help us learn about uh, the stars and, and the world around us as well. Quintico is the third Ontario park to achieve this designation, joining Lake Superior Provincial Park and Killarney. It also forms a vast area when combined in partnership with Minnesota. It's an international partnership. We are working with our partners across the border in Minnesota um, to create a very large region of public areas that protect the night sky from the negative effects of light pollution. But it's a long drive for those in the GTA who would like to see the skies at Quetico and the surrounding dark sky designated areas. From Toronto, you're looking at uh, about 28 hours a drive, so it's not a short trip. It's just uh, Quetico is located just to the west of Thunder Bay along the uh, Ontario-Minnesota border. To see all the places in the world that have the International Dark Sky designation, you can go to our website, citynews.ca slash extras. In Toronto, Audra Brown, City News.